Hi, I'm Sarah from SewingMastery.com, and today we're going to be starting in on the Husqvarna Viking Designer Jade 35 sewing machine and embroidery machine. Now we're going to do videos on every page of the manual, so they'll be short and sweet. You'll be able to find the information that you're looking for, and we start off by opening up the box and seeing what's inside. Are you ready to get started? Whether you're looking to purchase this machine or you already have and want to learn more about it, you'll want to check out all the videos that we're making. But this is always a fun part for me where we kind of dive into exactly the way this machine came to you from the factory. Now one thing that's a little different on this is this is a big box because both the sewing machine and the embroidery unit is all in one gigantic box. So you might need a little help getting it home or up the stairs or wherever your sewing room actually is. So you're going to notice that um, in the front part is the sewing machine. There's kind of some white styrofoam and then on the back there is another box with the embroidery unit here. You also have right on top is the embroidery info info intro software and your code so this machine comes with a nice basic package of embroidery software included with this machine so don't lose this piece of paper i'm going to try to set it here so i don't lose it right inside i see there is a small little um, oh, that's your power cord and we'll pull it out all right so we have two boxes in one. So I'm gonna move this box to the floor so it's a little easier for me to pull it out. So if you couldn't get the box fit in your car like I couldn't, you could open this box and take out the two separate boxes that are inside. I'm gonna pull out the smaller one. And this one is actually the embroidery module. And then this one, the other one, is actually the sewing machine. So easy to separate. If I would have known this when I brought it home, it would have been a lot easier to transport. And then you can get rid of the gigantic box that it came in. So for the soy machine, let's go ahead and see how this is packed all inside here. Right on top, you're gonna to find your manual and your warranty card. So I do like that they still put a printed manual in with the machine. And your foot control is gonna be kind of slipped down along this side. And with this machine, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually flip it over and let gravity help me just a little bit. Because then, and just slide this right on up. Now the sewing machine will be upside down, but we can handle that. So we'll flip this right on back. You kind of probably just pull one of those off. And the sewing machine. Now when you look at this, it looks very compact because it actually is. It almost has its own carrying case right over or integrated into it. And we'll show you how you get all your accessories all stored in here. Because on the back, there's a little spin, so that will release. And then watch this, this all pushes open. And then your accessories, power cord and foot con control can all fit in here. And then when you travel, that can just slide and it covers up the whole front of the machine and your handle takes it all with you. So it's super easy. And like I said, we'll go through all the accessories that comes with this machine in one of the next videos. So they're all right here, and I've kind of taped down into that little area. Are you ready to see what comes with the embroidery unit? Let's get into this next. So I'm gonna just slide some of my styrofoam this way, my sewing machine this way, my accessory, foot control. This is a nice lightweight box, you'll notice. And we'll just go ahead and break into it. Once again, if you kind of flip it over. So our embroidery unit and our hoop are all gonna be in here along with probably a few accessories. Great. 
I'm just going to open this up. Everything's in plastic, but once you get it out of the plastic, that isn't something that you really need to keep. So I'll be tossing this away. Great. So an embroidery unit is ready to be attached to the machine when you're ready to embroider. And then down inside the styrofoam is the embroidery hoop. This is a nice six by just over nine inches, not closer to nine and a half inches tall. Makes for a great embroidery machine at a wonderful price. So do check out you, you, this machine at your local Husqvarna Viking store and they'd be happy to let you see all of its wonderful features. Let you sew on it, try out the embroidery and remember how many things come packaged with this machine that really kind of puts it above all the other embroidery machines that Husqvarna Viking has and really includes some nice things at an entry level price. So you ready to get started? I can't wait to show you all the things that this machine will do.